welcome guys to yet another episode of Shared Moments with Justice. And today we are talking about content creation. And so I've invited these lovely ladies to share their experiences because they run a YouTube channel. And so I think they have quite a number of things to share their frustrations, their success story, mm. their experiences, okay. and basically how it feels to really run a YouTube channel yeah. in this modern day. So Karibuni Sana. Asante. Asante. This is Jeria and mm. this is Sonia. Please, guys, introduce yourself better than I've done. Where? <laughs> Where do you start from? <laughs> This is the hardest question. Wewe ni nani? Wewe ni nani? Hapa sasa ni CV unamwaga hivi eh? Kuna kuna wasee wanangoja sasa kusikia. Wacha nijenge CV ya kwanza tu ya kazi kwanza. I'm a social worker by studying and by profession. I've experienced a little bit. As you've heard, my name is Jeria, Jeria Mwege. And I am do you have to say ages? It's up to you. I mean, the choice is yours. I am qualified enough to be someone's person let's put it that way <laughs> okay edge to achieve wale watu wengine okay yeah and All i'm right. not i'm a not going person mm -hmm. i talk a lot by the way so mkisikia mm naongea sana mniwie radhi hii ni show ya kuongea ni kuongea sasa get ready yeah. Good. so basically uh -huh. i think nitaachia tu hapo i have so many things to say about myself so mm -hmm. yeah okay sonia <laughs> okay so i'm sonia as you've heard that's my name and uh, by profession i'm a teacher by the way oh uh, english i didn't know teacher. that yeah okay very much yeah. <laughs> and uh currently i'm doing interiors i do for both offices and uh, homes that mm -hmm. is what i do yeah so what else am i supposed to do okay so i'm um, an outgoing person i can't be an introvert but i also talk who runs a youtube channel and doesn't, doesn't talk, talk. <laughs> 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 yeah so yeah so guys we are happy to be here today and yeah. we hope to share more yeah good mm -hmm. all right so you're here because one you guys run a youtube channel yeah yep. tell me briefly about this particular channel that you run what kind of content do you guys uh, create she used to tell me from last year like, we need no, to start a channel oh, how old by the how old is the channel it's only one month. It's one okay, month. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah. Then so, you are perfect. But, yeah. But since last year, alikuwa ananiambia like, you know what? I used to laugh. I'm like, are you even serious? What are you going to tell people? Like, are you even fit to go on cameras and everything? And we will laugh about it. Mm -hmm. But uh, until now, this corona period, tulikuwa tu tumeka, you know, hakuna kazi. Jobs have been closed and we were like, by the way, why not? Mm. Because mm -hmm. it really doesn't mean kuna grade unafaa kufika so that you can start a YouTube channel. You can start from anywhere. Hata kama umekaa, unakula, unatembea. Yeah. So then we decided to come up with a channel by the name Binsari, Binsari Vlogs. V? Binsari. Binsari. Yeah. yeah. But Spices. now it's pronounced ah. as Binsari because the it has way. a B V. H. V. Yeah, good. Okay. Binsari Vlogs. Uh -huh. Yeah. And so you know the meaning. <laughs> It's like, a spice. Yeah, it's yeah. Like, a like a combination of all, of all, spices. all spices. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we decided because we are going to be all over, because me sipendi kukama lipa moja. So we decided let us just call it Minsari so yes. that we can spice the lives of others and also spice yeah. ourselves. Yeah. Because yeah. when we give you content, we yes. also give ourselves mm -hmm. at the same time. So what kind of yeah. content are we talking about that you guys uh, share that uh, spice up? Okay, uh, when we started, we actually decided we'll do all all in one like mm. we'll do travel but mm -hmm. size at ways travel mali. because kumefungwa everywhere and then now we can do food we can do relationships dating mm -hmm. is of it was mm -hmm. because you know i think uh size kila mtu akona so much experience and they are relatable actually especially in relationships yes yeah zinaweza kuwa na difference kidogo too so we decided like why not just talk it out there like so that other people can feel they are not left out, you know. Unajua mtu anaweza kuwa anafikiria, you know, ni mimi tu nimekuwa heartbroken, ni mimi si wewe peke yako. Maze kila mtu amepitia hiyo route and yes. You know when people want to start uh, YouTube channels uh, specifically, some freak out. Yeah. And for yeah. good reasons. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Number one, someone is like, what am I going to tell people? Good. <laughs> what is it that I'm going to say that people have, haven't, haven't already had? had. Mm. Yeah. You know. 
and then mm -hmm. There's so much involved in terms of the even the production process, mm -hmm. you know, coming up with ideas, being able to plan well mm -hmm. the the equipment that you need to even have the resources. So you and perhaps for those who have a media background, it's a little easy yeah. to to come in. But you guys, from your uh, introduction, don't <laughs> have any media or production Nothing. background. Yeah. So yeah. how has that experience been? running a YouTube channel without even a media background. So first of all, when we decided to start the YouTube channel, at a, we, our minds were thinking we need to have a camera. Yeah, Stunt. like mm -hmm, yeah, those things. But mm -hmm. I remember telling my mom, do you know someone who has a camera? And she was like, yeah, I have someone. Let me just go and borrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can to camera peke yake. So we didn't know we need a stand too. Even using that camera I took actually was a problem yes, because, yes. you know, it's not been your field at mm. any given point. Tunajua tu kuchukua simu na selfie. Selfie and yes. kupiga picha. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so we had a problem. We even had to call our neighbor mm. at kuja kutusaidia. The first video Mwenye that we na idea At about... least he had an idea. Mm. Juye yo camera cooperate. Mm. And it was actually so hard. But then again, tukajiambia, okay, you can start from anywhere. We can even use our phones. Mm. Because if you don't have, hakuna venye tungepata hizo camera sayo. Tell me specifically yeah. that first episode. Oh my How God. How was the planning around, uh, the planning and execution? You know, we planned of, of for almost, a, almost two weeks. Yeah. We could do a shot. Eh, he called blah, blah, blah. And then we were like, no, we are not even doing it. We almost gave up, by mm. the way. But uh, once he came in to help us, that is when now we decided. We woke up in the morning. He took by the whole day. A 10 minutes video. Video. Yes. <laughs> took us the whole day. Because, you know, Actually, at a content, like, you have to kupanga your content. Mm -hmm. evo, evo. We didn't even know that, by yes. the way. So, tulifika hapo on the first shoot. Munenda kuongea nini? At well, like, <laughs> wow. By the way, now we are <laughs> script. <laughs> <laughs> we, didn't, we didn't even have a script, by the way. Mm. Tulika tu. Mm -hmm. And then the guy is like, okay, one, two, three, start. Tumiangaliana. <laughs> Tumiangaliana. Where are we supposed to start from? Yes. So we actually learned pole pole, like, yeah. you know, Ukianda, Lazima, you must have a script. Mm -hmm. Lazima, Mjipange, what you're going to talk about. And then there's so much you can talk about. So you have to trim it down yes. to yes. your audience, to your target audience. Mm. Good, yeah. good. Mm. Mm -hmm. And then there's also this aspect, Unashanga, like, um, if I talk this, how will these people react? Mm -hmm. Is this content right for this age? Yeah, so you, you're continuously thinking about yeah. the person We are thinking is, about the audience. The audience. Yes. And then, remember, we have parents. Mm -hmm. And then, we've been talking, if you've seen our channel, whatever yes. we are talking mm -hmm. about, it's focusing on our lifestyle mm -hmm. since Tukwe Watoto. I all the way, the way we were, we were raised. Ni kama muna jianika. Yeah, ni kama like, jianika. <laughs> you're putting your, your life out there. Yeah, yeah. which and is a crime. Okay. Hey. Yes. Kwanza mzazi, mm -hmm. I remember there's this video that we posted. And then her mom, aka Twitter candle, she was like, you guys didn't even run this by me. How could you just go and air something like that? Mbona mnatuwa nika, mnajwa mnatuwa ibisha, you know? But, you know, those are the things that we're always afraid of. Like, before we even air something out, tunaulizana like, will this go well with the parents? Mm -hmm. And and you see that that's that can be a, a limitation really yeah. very much yeah. in, you it know is. trying to express be real mm -hmm. because people out there are looking for content that is real things yeah. that people can actually identify with mm -hmm. and when you think about your parents your friends mm -hmm. sometimes that can be a limitation mm -hmm. in terms of very how far much. you can go in sharing mm -hmm. it's something that can actually be very helpful if you share but because at the back of your mind, you're thinking, how will my parents look at me after sharing this? Yeah, how will yeah. my friends, you know, look at me? So how, what have you done to try to overcome that, that uh, you know, hindrance? We decided, by the way, we are going to take all these comments to Zichukwe, we sit. Because even from those other comments, then you're scared, you're disappointed, mm -hmm. you can, you learn one or two things from is of it zote. Yes. So once you embrace that, like kuchukwe zo comment zote, then it becomes actually easier. Even if you see that negative comment, you learn to get a positive outcome from it. And feedback is yeah. key, by yeah. the way. Feedback yeah. is very, You cannot run a YouTube yeah. channel and run away from mm. feedback. Mm. Yeah. And mostly... So, negative some yeah. most of the feedback is negative i don't know mm -hmm. your experience yeah but we've got, i know there are people negative. out there who are just yeah i, think, I know <laughs> i think people are stressed yeah 
So <laughs> they are trying to vent mm -hmm. and in the process just trying to vent it on other people. Okay, most of the feedback since it's coming from our friends. Yes. <laughs> of course it's positive. <laughs> they are soft. So yeah, they are soft. But then again, Kunawale Sasa, they are using now our friends' friends. You know, if you tell subscribers to subscribe, they mm. have friends, friends, friends. Yes. So there are those who are coming now behind our friends. Now they are texting on the normal chat. Mm. Well, because our friends are good enough, for you to me your feedback, wana tutumia. Yes. So, hey, kwanza kuna ingini litushika vibaya sana. <laughs> <laughs> but we dealt with it. We dealt with it. But ili tusumbua. <laughs> you know the problem, you know, that person was concentrating on our outlook. If I just say how alikuwa nasema, uh, achikuwa ni you guys, are you in competition of, what was the word? <laughs> no. <laughs> Same, okay, same. she was like, you know, hey, and you guys are big, both of you. Uh, yeah. uh, and you know, and why did you even dress like that? Yeah. You I don't even have, have chemistry. You don't even have so chemistry. So you're like, what is chemistry? <laughs> okay, then we were like, by the way, what is chemistry? And then now we learned about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think mm -hmm. we just uh, figured out a way, yes, like, yes. you could hear those comments to make out a positive impact. So it was a negative it, it was a comment yeah, that yeah. perhaps could be able to help you, yeah. but yeah. framed but negatively. Framing the but framing it you was, could still pick yeah, some we elements picked, from actually, it. We, we picked the chemistry. Yeah, the, the elements from it, and <laughs> I think it has really helped Pia, because we were able to know now the chemistry, like, you know, you're talking, and mm. before you even finish your statement, yeah. Yeah. Yes. so now we were able to organize ourselves. And bring out our content clearly. Mm. Yeah. So we were when you go and be able to have a chemistry. We'll do some idea by yeah, let's say idea, let's say idea. Yeah. Talking of uh, mm -hmm. audience, mm -hmm. you see, when you're beginning, perhaps you're counting on um, your other followers, say mm -hmm. on your social media, mm -hmm. <coughs> yeah. on Facebook, on Instagram. So mtu anaji chocha na sema, eh, by the way, mina wana nikona wase. I have followers. If I start a channel, I believe nikiangusha hivi video, I have a thousand views in subscribers. You know, was that the experience? Oh my God. We were like talking with her. She's like, you know, on Facebook, I have like 1,000 followers. Na mimi, I have like 1,000 followers. Maybe, wale mucho ni like 10 or 20. So we have at least different uh, groups of people mm. so if they join we are going to get many views and, and subscribers. subscribers it was on our <laughs> shock <laughs> actually it doesn't work like that yeah it's not really easy to get those subscribers but uh because to meanza our reception is good mm. because mostly most of our videos we may part of 500 and above views within yes. a month so I think that is a good reception. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come at the first video right now, it has a 900 subscribers. Ah, uh, sorry. Views. So you're like, if these views could be converted to the <laughs> to sub subscribers. subscribers, I mean, we will be there. We will yeah. be there. <laughs> but but it, doesn't doesn't, work, it doesn't, it doesn't like work like that. that. Yeah. Oh. So, ni pole pole tu. Unambia mtu subscribe, and I yeah, nita subscribe. But then again, maybe it's either anenda and I forget, ama tu, they don't subscribe. I think patience works a lot. And just concentrate not on subscribers, concentrating more on your content, what you're giving your audience. There's a risk of you getting, you know, lost in the whole subscriber and mm. views thing. Yeah. Until you forget what the core mandate is, which is content creation. Yeah. And trying to make a difference in terms of what you talk about. Yeah. So I think it's very important to bring that up. Mm -hmm. That we should not be lost in the yeah, all subscri in much as, subscribers. Much as it's important to have people watching mm -hmm. yeah. and following what we are doing, we should not make it the primary, you know, goal. Yeah. Let's talk about uh, some of the, the technical aspects of your production. Mm -hmm. What do you use to shoot your videos and uh, to light or, you know, background and things like that? Mm -hmm. Okay, the first time to Lianza Naka camera, we were so good. Uh -huh. hey, light on a journey, you are. So in a time, in yeah, yeah, in just okay. Yeah, so you have to time work at it. The sun is uh, it's perfect. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's when we were shooting. Then to Kashindo a corporate camera, because Munyalkwa na tsaidia anyway, Alikuja Katwambia time up. Yeah. Mimi ni kona biashara zangu. Oh. Yeah, so we decided to switch to come uh, to our phones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So I love Pia. There is another challenge, Pia. Munya Pia na to be a bad your phone ye you and ye see ya see ye tu niake. So when mm -hmm. he's Busy with it, mm. we have to wait. So we decided to use our phones. I tried with my phone. It has good camera, yes. but now voice. Silent. Aina sauti. Mm. Yeah. 
iPhone. I remember tulichukua kuna siku tulichukua video like a whole video it was perfect. Wacha tuende kusikiza kabisa. Hakuna <laughs> sauti. <laughs> There was like you couldn't even hear anything. So we had to start again with her phone. Mm. So we've been using phones by then a challenge sana because mm. sa zingine we depend on the sun venya mesema for lighting. Mm-hmm. So jua ikienda because sometimes you can see the sun and then cloud kinakuja. So you have to stop because kuna variation ya yes, the yes, brightness huku yes. kuna jua huku ni darkness. Yeah, so it's been a challenge but we are learning slowly and slowly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so I remember this this day tulikuwa tunataka shoot video kwa nyumba. It was ni venye tu sasa July imeanza you know it's cold hakuna mm-hmm. jua nje. So mm-hmm. we were like okay let's just try kwa nyumba kuna lighting hey tumejaribu kamera tumeweka vizuri but tunaangalia ah huko unaonekana dark huko unaonekana dark sisi hao tunachukua stool <laughs> we <laughs> took that big torch eh torch tunamulika huko juu ndio sasa tuone try to improvise na yeah, lights the Impro- yeah ku improvise yeah. sasa tunakuwa ni, ni watu wa production uh-huh. by default yes it's very important when you are setting up for production to at least think about some of yeah. those things ahead of time yeah. when you think about your location where you're going to shoot from the time of day that you're going to shoot because that informs the issues of sun that you're mm-hmm. talking about and sometimes when you're shooting in uh, in the middle of the day the sun is too harsh yeah so it's good to at least consider either if you're shooting outdoor consider shooting either in the morning hours or mm. in the evening at least that gives you some good uh, s- lighting, s- yeah. some balanced mm. kind of lighting yeah you know and you know the issue of uh, sound You can have a very good video but if it doesn't yeah. have yeah if we can't hear what you are saying then it's, then it's as good as, good as nothing no video yeah so sound is very important mm. so by you saying and especially if now you're using a phone to record both video and audio mm-hmm. if that's the only thing you have yeah. what i would advise to do is at least don't have the phone too far from the subject mm-hmm. because the further you put uh, the phone then oh. you're limiting your projection uh, of voice to the microphone mm-hmm. of the phone so make sure that the, the phone is close enough at least to get the whole shot but close enough so that you you can capture yeah. the audio uh, a little better mm-hmm. than it would be if the phone is far away Instead of but shooting. if yeah. you can be able to find some little gadgets like mm-hmm. uh, microphones mm-hmm. to incorporate in your mm-hmm. shoot they make a whole difference and your sound will be better oh, yeah, you know people true. would appreciate your content more if they can hear you clearly yeah. but kukiwa na ma echo mtu you know oh ama you know mm. sound is it's, it's full people of background passing. noise and all that <laughs> then it becomes a little noisy yeah. and uncoordinated so people lose interest yeah. yeah they don't give you a chance to listen to what you are saying they dismiss you from the word go mm. one because they're like ah Ah, mm, and yet kabisa. you put in a lot of effort lot to even effort. do the small Imagine. things that you're doing. Yeah, it's you know, so, so it's effective. important to think about those things ahead of time before you even start the shoot. Yeah. And perhaps the other tip I would give is mm-hmm. if uh, for instance in your case two of you are coming up with the content so basically you are on set. Mm-hmm. It's good to find a reliable person mm-hmm. who you can bring on board now to be able to assist you with the technical details. Sometimes it's very difficult to be thinking about the reception of the feed or how the the picture looks like on the other yeah. end how the audio is on the other end when you're sitting here yeah so if you have someone else sitting on the other side they can be able to at least look at those things that you are not able to look at okay. when you're seated here so it's important to at least grow your team slightly find mm-hmm. someone who shares in your vision at this point you might not be able to start paying people to do this so yeah. you need to find a friend who would uh, at least have interest and some knowledge yeah. in uh, production to be able to assist to try and improve your productions it's very important to improve productions as you grow other than just the content the production aspect is key so we are using our phones yes so which is the best position should it be like the, the front portrait? camera no or the back camera when mm-hmm. you are shooting mm-hmm. like how should you place your phone most phones have uh, the back camera with higher resolution than the front than the front camera mm. so use the back camera 
and that's why now you need another person to help and then the other thing would be how you hold the camera whether on portrait mode or landscape, landscape mode advisably let your camera be on landscape mode why mm -hmm. because most of the platforms that you'll be uploading your content if you're creating for youtube then youtube has a landscape mode in mm -hmm. terms of the orientation so if you shoot in a portrait mode you're holding your phone like this mm -hmm. then when you upload that content to youtube it acqua it acha some spaces yeah. black spaces oh, okay. on the sides yeah. unless you're shooting for insta stories mm. insta stories ndio zinatumia yeah. they take advantage ah. of the portrait, portrait mode we'll be progressing of course with the channel mm -hmm. And at some point, we'd want to buy these uh, equipment. Yes. So which ones are the ones that you'd recommend at first? Because yes. if you decide buying, they are, I know they are very expensive and at mm -hmm, So mm -hmm. easy in Dogondogo, to idea. Which ones would you recommend? I think, first of all, I have to commend you guys that uh, mm -hmm. you're already doing something with the little that you have. Mm -hmm. You know, most people wait until they want to put in place all the infrastructure needed mm -hmm. to be able to start doing something. But I think it's important to start with what you have. Yeah. Pole pole, you increase, you grow slowly. So what you're doing so far is commendable. Now, the next step would be, before you bring in any additional gadgets or equipment, to look at your current setting and mm -hmm. see where the gaps are. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of options available for cameras. But of course, one thing that will inform your choice, number one, is your pocket. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> How much you want to spend. And then your needs. So if you want a camera that shoots, if you're shooting indoor, for example, you need a camera that can be able to shoot in low light, mm -hmm. such that even when you don't have a lot of light, that camera can still be able to give you a, a, a well-exposed uh, video and then you're perhaps looking at a camera that has a microphone input if you're vlogging you need a, a camera that can be able to, you can be able to flip the screen yeah. so that you can be able to see what you are filming once you flip the screen of the camera mm -hmm. so those are, so, those yeah. are some of the considerations mm -hmm. and then of course the quality in terms of the video quality that that camera gives you if you're doing indoor shoots, of course, lights are very important. Mm -hmm. If possible, get a lapel mic that you can be able to either connect to your phone or to your camera. It will really make a whole difference. If you don't have a microphone mm -hmm. and you still want to use a phone to record your audio, I would advise to use two phones. One phone for video, and one sound. phone for sound. Mm -hmm. The phone that is recording your video is slightly some distance from you and you would want to capture some crisp and clear audio. So get a second phone and put it closer to you, mm -hmm. perhaps if you're seated like this, somewhere in between, in oh. so that it can specifically record audio. This is the audio that you're going to use alongside the video. The other phone is recording both audio and video, mm -hmm. but you will not use the audio because audio. it's quite some distance and it will not be as clear as this audio that you're recording uh -huh. from a phone that is next to you. Mm -hmm. But basically, you need to also make sure that your footage is stable. Kuna hii story, unapata msia shoot video, but the thing is shaky, it's all, all over. It's all over. You know, the, <laughs> the phone is moving, the people are moving, you know, it's destructive. It's yeah. destructive. So make sure that your footage is stable. And the way to achieve stability is to make sure you're shooting on a tripod. So I think I, re I already like the fact that you guys are already doing something and you're you know, willing to keep improving. You're not ashamed of the mistakes <laughs> that you've made in the process of learning, yeah. which I think is a very important uh, uh, thing for you know, yourself and mm. for anyone who mm -hmm. finds themselves in this uh, mm -hmm. uh, field. It's important to know that you're going to make mistakes as you begin. Yeah. Yeah. But kwa mistakes have... Uh, I mean, be willing to learn from those mistakes and take advantage of the available platforms and information so that you keep growing, keep yeah. growing. Mm -hmm. You know, go online. Before you, mm -hmm. you, you know, start a shoot, just go online, go to YouTube, search, okay, how to mm -hmm. use a phone to record 
a good video. video. Yeah. You get a lot of videos, a lot of yeah. options. And I think you guys are headed in the right direction. I know we're coming to a close of the show. Give me your parting shot. Give me your closing mom comments. Okay, so what I'd like to tell you guys, the ones who are listening and watching, like it's never too late to start, you know. And uh, you can start from anywhere. And when you're starting, do not compare yourself with other people because everyone starts on their own level and everyone is going with their own pace. Mm. So just start from anywhere with whatever you want and you'll definitely grow if you put your energy and your determination into something. I hope that in the near future we are able to impact people because uh, the small thing that you think uh, it's impacting someone else. Like someone else is getting encouraged because uh, even from our um, comments, we are able to see some comments. Mm. Then uh, even some people were inboxing us. Oh my God, at least I see I'm not the only one. Mm. No, no. So someone just feels like they're part of a certain community. They are not all alone outside there. So we hope to impact people in a little way, a bigger way. Just at the end of the day, we are able to impact people. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yeah. Jeria. Me, I only have a few words. Uh, first of all, uh, as it's a learning process, just like we've said. Ni mtu If you're planning on starting a channel, don't even think about others. I remember when I started, uh, I thought about the channel. Nilingia mm -hmm. YouTube. Nika search how to start a YouTube channel. So I'll just say like, keep doing whatever you're doing if you're part of, a, of a, the YouTuber society now that we are. You know, let's continue doing it. And if we get um, negative feedbacks, they make us stronger. Yeah. Okay, so we'd like to thank you for this opportunity. It's a very, very big stepping stone for our growth. And uh, guys, before we finish, we'd like to request you, please, you subscribe to our channel, Vinsari Vlogs. So it's a B-H-I-N-S-A-R-Y. Mm -hmm. -Y. And then Vlogs. Vlogs. So please don't forget also to subscribe on his channel, Shared, shared moments. Shared moments. And then uh, share your experiences on Shared Moments. Exactly. Bring your moments on Shared, shared moments. moments. We thank you so much for your continued support. Thank you guys. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think thank it's you. been a um, beautiful moment. Yeah. Sharing experiences, mm -hmm. challenges, success yeah. stories and all that. And this I think is going to, be, to go a long way. In even helping those who have had this dream for, mm -hmm. a, long time, for a long time, but for some reason they've been held mm -hmm. back because mm -hmm. they think they don't have the, you know, equipment. Mm -hmm. So thanks for sharing this. Mm -hmm. And remember, I've also done a few videos that can give you tips on more or less other production aspects. So be sure to check them out on Shared Moments. So let's keep it consistent. Let's keep planning. Let's keep supporting. So until next time, that's all I've had time for. Thank you so much for watching. God bless. Remember to subscribe. Santa Santa.